Assalamu alaikum my dear friends welcome back to my channel I'm your host Abdurrahman Turkman from Mazar Sharif Afghanistan in today's video I want to show you how to find your Android phone or tablet even when it's on silent mode have you ever lost or forgotten your phone in a place we are not finding it then in this video I want to show you how to find your phone even when it's on silent mode sounds crazy huh so let's do this mother father thing <laughs> Okay, first of all, I'll turn my this phone into silent mode. Okay, now my phone is on silent mode. Now pretend that I have lost this phone and I have problem finding it. Even I call, I call to this phone to find it. It doesn't ring because it's on silent mode. And now I'll show you how to find this. Okay, to find your lost or stolen phone, turn on your computer and go to Google. After that, type Google. Google Android Device Manager After that click on the first link which is Android Device Manager dash Google just click on that after that type your Gmail address which you are using on your lost phone now you will get into this page where Google will locate your phone so as you can see here is my my phone's location just double click on this thing Just keep double clicking on it and it will show you the exact location of your phone. If this if this map didn't help to find your Android phone, then you should use these three options over here. The first one is ring and the other one is lock and the third one is erase. In case you couldn't find your phone through this map, then you should go with ring. When you click when you click on this ring ring button, it will ring your device. So let's go ahead and check it. Just click on the ring this device. Yes. Now you can see it's ringing. Okay, as you can see now my phone is ringing. While the phone is ringing, go ahead and search for your phone in your house. Okay, after ringing your device, you should find your phone if you think that your phone is not lost it's stolen then you should choose you should use this option this the second option which is lock what it what it does is it will lock your your phone with a new password of your choice so let's try this option now lock your phone with a new password so I'm going to give new password to my phone confirm password okay now here here's another option which is recovery message if you think that your phone is lost then you can you can give a message to finder to return your phone to you I'll tap here if the phone found on phone number you can give your phone number so I'll tap my phone number after that click on lock once you click on lock your phone will be locked to open the phone so let's go ahead and lock it now you can see my phone is locked here's the message which I typed on my computer if the phone found please contact this number just when you click on this call owner it will call Okay, if your phone is stolen and the person who found your phone is not returning you the phone, then you should go with the third option. The third option is erase. What it will do is it will erase all of the data into your stolen Android phone. If you don't want your personal data to be exposed, then you should choose this op this option erase. Once you click on that, it will give you some messages which which says by clicking on erase all of your data will be erased okay guys that's it i hope you find this tutorial helpful if you like this video please share it with your friends and give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos like this and i'll see you on my next video till then keep watching my videos and goodbye